Hey guys, how's it going? It is Sam here and welcome to this video. So this video is going to be a bank video. Um, I haven't made one in quite a long time so I decided to uh, actually uh, do one. I've, I've had a few friends say that um, you know I should make one so I thought why not? Um, they're quite easy to do and everyone seems to like it. So um, let's get started. Just want to have a quick shout out to this guy next to me. Have you smoked? Um, he just happened to be in the video right next to me so um, yeah, shout out to you. Um, so just like always, the bank video is just about me going to go through my bank, um, just discussing the items I've got in there and uh, the setup. So um, let's get started. So I'm uh, in Edgeville right now. This is my first tab. Um, the first item I have in my bank, I've always had it, is my cash. I currently have 46 mil, or yeah, pretty much 46 mil. So, um, you know, a fair bit of cash. Um, good enough to flip uh, quite a few items of that. So, um, you know, it's cool to have that much. Uh, I can flip like spectrals and getting close to arcanes now, so it is a nice to uh, have that much money. Um, so that is awesome. That's my money. Um, next, I have my fish. Uh, I've got 2.2k monkfish, 207k sharks. That's just a merch I'm doing. So um, you know that's the reason why I've got that much. Um, I'm waiting for the bot nuke to come out so they all go up in price and I make like 100 mil from these. So uh, that's going to be awesome. I've uh, got rock tails there. I haven't got any because um, I don't really need them at the moment because I've got so much fish uh, anyway. Uh, I don't need to buy rock tails. Sharks are good enough in my opinion. Um, rock tails are just a bit too expensive for me. Um, ring of forging. Uh, all this stuff, as you can see now, like ring of forging, iron ore, iron bar, all of this sort of um, resources are for my uh, statue statue collection uh, that I'm doing. It's the Shattered Heart mini game where you've got to get different rocks from different skills skills. Um, this is what I use to um, get them so for smithing I've got like the iron ore and iron bars um, or I could make uh, some like iron plate bodies, iron knives of these. I've got fire making, fletching, stuff like that. Construction, fishing, cooking uh, and uh, yeah pretty much every skill. Um, some skills you know you don't need supplies for but um, I like to just have them here so they're easy to get out and um, you know they're just generally easy to get a move on because uh, with this um, statue minigame thing. Um, you can get the rocks pretty fast. It's just nice to have them right at the first tab so I can quickly grab them out and uh, get on with the next skill. Uh, so that's my first tab done. Um, also got actually my uh, overloads and um, prayer renewals. This is for dungeoneering. Um, you know, I quickly drink this before I go into a dungeon. Um, it helps uh, the dungeon because you get a five minute uh, stat boost of the overload and uh, same with the prayer renewal. But um, it just renews your prayer, so I'm um, helpful to have these. Um, so that is awesome. I've uh, got my max cape here. I wear this quite a lot, so I just have it at the first tab. Um, and then here is my statue collection bag, which, um, if I actually have a look in right now, I've got quite a few. Um, well, not that many actually. Just some rocks. Uh, I've got fire making, wood cutting, one fishing, cooking, and a fletching. So uh, not bad. Um, so my next tab is. Uh, magic, teleporting, stuff like that. Got all my runes. Uh, I have quite a lot of runes. I never really sell them because uh, I'm, I don't, I don't know. I just seem to just keep my runes. I uh, got 10k lore runes, nearly 100k air runes, 12k fire runes. I'm not going to go through all of them, but um, the main ones I've got 60k pure essence for um, rune crafting, 10k nature runes, 6k astral runes, 4k deaths, and 6k bloods. So you know, quite a fair bit. Um, of runes there, so um, can last for quite a long time. Uh, that is awesome. And then next to them, I've got all my tele tabs. So I've got teleport to house, varrock, all of the places pretty much that um, I go to. Uh, so it's really useful. And then I've got my um, spe special sort of tabs which you can make from uh, doing the love story quest. You can like use a chisel on these, and you can customize it where you want to go. So I've got Trollheim and Brimhaven, just a few other places which are you know quite hard to get to, uh, including Relica. Uh, so that's good. Next, I've got all my just rings, jewelry, stuff like that. I've got my necklace, game's neck, um, ring of jeweling, glories. I've got my grog pouches for runecrafting and that. Um, I've got my pouches, uh, wicked hood, and then just a few random stuff down here. Um, in one of my previous videos, I said that uh, I was getting one mil nat. Um, so far, I haven't really like, progressed with that very far. Um, I've only got 10k right now. Um, I just really haven't got the time to do that right now. Um, decided to get the completionist cape first before I uh, go for the one mil nat, so that's going to be delayed for a little bit, but um, I'm still going to be aiming for that. 
once I've got my comp cape, I'll have time to just, you know, do this because there won't be much for me to do after that. Uh, I might do some trimmed requirements, but um, yeah, I'm gonna real take it real slow when I got my comp cape. So um, yeah, that one mil nats could uh could actually come true. Um, so yeah, that's my second tab: uh, runes, magic, rune crafting, stuff like that. So uh, that is awesome. Next tab is uh, potions, herb lore, um, pretty much. Um, I haven't got many overloads, I've never really had that many overloads just because um, they're really expensive to make. I know I have quite a lot of money but um, I go through overloads quite fast. Uh, I've got 11 flasks, um, 22 prayer renewal flasks. Um, I've got quite a lot of brews actually. I decided to buy them because they're quite cheap at the moment. If I don't actually just have a quick price check just to see how much they are then um, I can just see it. So 4.7k for a brew, that is really cheap. These used to be like 12k. Um, so yeah, it's a good thing that they've gone down, but I think they're not as good in the the combat update, so um, that's probably why. Uh, and then they got the 12.2k for the brew flask, so yeah, it's quite a lot more expensive just for the extra two dose. Um, so I wouldn't really recommend buying them right now. Um, just got you know your average sort of extremes and other sort of potions that you'd need. Got quite a lot of prayer pots. Um, this is sort of another sort of merch, except I'm not actually selling them. I just decided to buy them because they're really cheap at the moment. Um, I think they're about 2k each. Oh, wow, they've actually gone up. Um, I did actually buy them for 2k, 2.2k. So um, you know, I've made a little bit of money there. But like I said, I'm not going to sell them. So um, yeah, there's not going to be any profit there. But if I do, then you know, I'm going to make a bit of profit. Um, got loads of extreme attacks. Uh, the reason is because I used them to get 99 herblore. Quite a long time ago, actually. Now, um, so yeah, I've got a load of them, nearly 20k extreme attacks. I did. I do wish I did um, sort of a bit more, like 5k of each. So it's a bit more even, but um, yeah, that's just not the case. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's my um, potion tab. I do need to clean this up a little bit. As you can see, I've got loads of sort of like already drank potions which need to be like uh, put together again so they all go back into four doses but um, I'll do that when um, I finish vid this video or something um, but yeah that's the third tab the fourth tab is summoning it's quite a simple sort of tab uh, not really much to not really much in it uh, I've just got my charms I've got 1.6k gold 900 green 2.1k crimsons uh, 1.6k blue um, I do have 99 summoning so you know I haven't used these since I've uh, got 99 I just collect them. Um, I mainly collect crimsons and blues. Um, I don't pick up gold or green uh, because it's just really not too worth it when you're 99. Um, all the pouches and scrolls I've got is uh, the main ones I use. So I got Pack Yak, uh, my favourite familiar. Uh, I got Unicorn and Steel Titan. They're my three main ones. And then just helpful ones underneath, such as Bunyip, Terrorbird, uh, Abyssal Titan, uh, Geyser Titan. Um, not really too sure how to pronounce that but um, yeah that pouch I've uh, got Lava Titan pouch and then just pouches and shards um, but yeah that's my summoning tab uh, the fourth one the fifth one is farming um, slash herbal I guess I've got some uh, herbs down here but um, most of these are just sort of your, your random like farming items such as pineapples coconuts stuff like that payments for trees, even though I don't do farmlands anymore, I just decided to have them anyway. Um, got uh, some of the seconds for potions, 1.8k super compost, decided to buy that because uh, I kept getting low on them so I just decided to buy like 2k super compost so I don't have to keep buying more. Uh, cost like 2 mil or something like that, <laughs> quite a lot but um, yeah, um, that's that. Got loads of vials and vial of water, um, 162 juju farming pots, uh, quite a few seeds. Um, I actually picked these up, these 2k marigold seeds. Some guy just randomly dropped them, so I thought I'd take them and uh, do my own. Um, I've got 73 more killer mushrooms. Um, that's pretty much it. And then at the bottom here, I just uh, got the items which I use for my farm runs. So I've got Explorer's Ring, Ectophile, Witch Doctor Mask, RD Cape 4, and uh, Magic Secateurs. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it for that tab. Um, next is my junk tab. Um, anything that doesn't fit into the previous tabs or the upcoming tabs, and I, I just lob it all in here. Um, I've got 500k tockle, so quite a lot. Um, I don't know how much that is worth or how much like a, an onyx is or something, but I've just got quite a lot there um, for my slayer tasks. Um, but yeah, nothing really too interesting in here. I do have a few things which are worth quite a lot. Um, 
got a dragon pickaxe, I got gilded from a lava flow mines, uh, got a Dx, a mystic mud staff, inferno adds, got a um, seaside rock and candy floss from the school of fortune, um, 3.8k Canada flakes, fire cape, you know just random stuff which is just helpful now and then but um, nothing too amazing. Uh, so yeah, um, I'm going to skip this tab because it's my most valuable tab, it's my combat tab. Um, I'm going to go to the next one which is um, Complete Dragon Collection. Um, not really going to go into this too much but um, this is the items I've got in the series so far. Um, I still need to record actually episode 4, I haven't done that in quite a long time, mainly because I've been busy but um, yeah, I have, I'm going to get unlimited internet very very soon. Um, it's actually tomorrow I'm getting it when I'm recording this video. So um, yeah, that means I'll be able to do live streams and stuff like that. But uh, yeah, so my final tab is my combat tab. This is my favourite one. Um, I'm gonna go through most things now. I've got 47 ferocious rings. Got that from Slayer. Um, I love Slayer. Uh, one of my well, is my favourite skill actually. So um, that's why I've got loads of rings from that dungeon. Um, got 12k cannonballs for like frost dragons or like bloodveld tasks. Um, got quite a few there. Got 334, no, 314 ruby bolts, 5k diamond bolts. I actually forgot I bought them, but that was for a uh, Nex, which I need to go there again. Haven't been there in quite a long time. Um, got Ancient Ceremonial for uh, getting into the Nex without getting KC, it's helpful. Um, just random Barrows gear and this combat stuff that you need. Six Dragon Defenders. Um, I've got all the Chaotics. I've got Chaotic Kai Shield, Chaotic Staff. Chaotic Maul, Chaotic Longsword, Chaotic Crossbow, Farseer Kite Shield, uh, Chaotic Rapier, and uh, Evil Eye Kite Shield. I think that's everything. Um, so, uh, yeah, I've got all of that from Dungeoneering. And I think I've got about 200k tokens again anyway, so, um, you know, I uh, don't know what to spend them on. But um, the auras I've got are Blazing Gaze, which is the orange eyes. I've got Seren, Seren Gaze. I think that's how you say it. That's the blue eyes. I just thought they were pretty cool, so I got them. And I've got Vampirism, this one is really helpful and uh, yeah, it's really good. I recommend getting that. It um, heals you 5% for every damage you do, so it's really good. Um, got my Archer Ring imbued, Seer's Ring imbued, and Onyx Ring imbued, and also my Berserk Ring imbued. That's from uh, Mobilizing Armies, takes quite a long time to get it though, it's really boring. Um, but uh, yeah, I'm glad that's out the way with. Uh, but uh, that is awesome. I've got Ganodermic, Arcane Stream. Uh, Polypore Staff, I've got Void, um, let's see, I'm looking at anything else which is interesting, I've got Goliath Gloves um, from Dominion Tower, they're really helpful, uh, I've also got Spellcaster Gloves there, and I uh, don't know if I've got Swift Gloves or not, but um, yeah, I did have them, uh, they must have degraded, but I've got Goliath Gloves there as well, that's just a different um, colour. Uh, Zami Spear, BGS, um, Armadil Helmet, I've got full Armadil, uh, there it is there, I've got Bandos, Chestplate and Tassets, I've got all of the uh, Glace, Glacer Boots, um, right there, so I've got Ragefire, Steadfast and Glaven, I actually got these Steadfast as a drop, so uh, that's awesome. Uh, I've got D Claws, I've got the Tokar Calcate, which got graphically updated, I'll show you that, and um, yeah, I've got my F Amulet Fury, which has an ornament kit on it. And uh, this is pretty cool actually, because if I split it um, and I price check the kit, I actually bought this for 18 mil and it's gone up to nearly 26 mil now, so um, that's a lucky buy for me. I uh, saved myself 7 mil. Um, if you're wondering, wondering what it does, it just um, makes your fury look a bit better. <laughs> and it's quite a lot of money for um, just a little thing, but um, I do like it, so that's why I got it. So there it is. Um, if you want to look at the new Tokar Calcate which got dated, uh, there it is. I think it looks awesome. When you run, it uh, has like a trail behind it. Uh, that is cool. And um, I was just going to quickly price check these D-claws because I know they went down. They're 9.8 mil. I remember I used to do TDs which dropped these and uh, I caught one as a drop and they were, they were like 35 mil back then. So it was awesome. But uh, now they've gone down which kind of sucks. But um, oh well, there's nothing I can do about that. But uh, that pretty much is it for my bank. Sorry it hasn't changed since my last one too much. Um, it's just a pain changing my bank and everything, so uh, that's why I don't really do it. But um, that is it for my bank video. 
I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give the video a like. Um, if you've got any video ideas for me to do, then please leave that in the comments. Or if I've uh, missed something out on my bank video, please put it in the comments too. But apart from that, thanks for watching. Um, a shout out to everyone in my clan chat. Thanks for being in there. You guys are awesome. And uh, apart from that, guys, I will see you in my next video. So peace out.